We do a lot of like driving around in the vans. We've got our workman's boots on and our Dickies trousers and you know, we're covered in mud and just even like walking around or hopping out of the van in London, <laughs> you get these looks from, from people all the time. It's kind of a, quite a satisfying thing. I have always wanted to be in a career that's more outdoor based and more kind of physically intensive. I just, as a person, am more inclined towards kind of practical hands-on stuff. Um, so it's always been a big appeal for me. The job I had before this was indoors and at a desk all day. I couldn't see what I was actually doing. So I actually like being on the ground and working outdoors and with the trees has been great. Um, and seeing them at different stages of their life, I just feel more in touch with the work that I'm doing, I guess. A lot of people think that manual labour is just, you're just doing and you're not thinking. Yeah. Whereas actually a lot of these people specialise in different things because there's so much knowledge and it's not just putting a tree in the ground, you know. So. I think it's a noticeable transition from when I started seven years ago that we do now have a predominantly female team and it's just something that's happened organically and naturally. The best people for the job were with the women that applied and then now we've got the team we've got and people are working and on the ground. It hasn't made any difference in terms of the quality or quantity of work that's carried out, but I do think it's made a difference in that we're representative now. We, when we go out and we work with volunteers that have young girls in the group, that's quite a poignant thing to be showing them that you can do a, a practical job if that's what you want to do. I've had it loads of times if I'm helping out the build team where kids will be coming across the playground, they'll see me working with the build team, they go, look, look, it's a, it's a female workman, <laughs> you know? which is really cute. Because like, they don't realise that you can have a female version of someone who's doing that kind of job until they see it. Yeah. I used to drive JCB diggers and um, small children would openly gawk at me and say things like, it's a lady digger driver, which always made me very proud when it was a little girl. It's like, yeah, you can be a digger driver too. <laughs> I didn't really think I would be able to get a job like this and then coming here and just everyone's so supportive and being around women like it's not even a question you know of like oh are you sure you can do that kind of thing. It's really exciting working in an organisation that's got such a presence of women in those senior leadership roles. As a young mum, it makes for a really inclusive workspace. So, you know, and I do think that's important. But it's been so nice to be able to, just to like not take it too seriously, just have a good time and making sure that we all feel that we have a purpose whilst doing the job, because we speak about that all the time, that as long as the job we're doing actually contributes something that's really important, that's the main thing and you know we all work equally hard and it's kind of like a little family it's really cool